Doctor, you have one minute to live. Me starts planking. What are you doing? Making this minute feel like a lifetime. How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to MK. I'm your host, Robin, and today we're going to be taking a look at r slash me IRL. I've got nothing clever to say, so without much further ado, let's get right to it, shall we? Ryan Burton's senior quote is, Dang, Ryan just stole my girl again. Every guy. Right, Ryan, right. What a week, huh? Captain, it's Wednesday. I think we've all been feeling this the entirety of 2020. It's officially that that wear a sweater in the morning, regret it in the afternoon type of weather. Oh god, I live in Colorado, don't get me started on that type of weather, man. Oh my god, John. I'm driving with do not disturb while driving turned on. I'll see your message when I get where I'm going. I'm not receiving notifications. If this is urgent, reply urgent to send a notification through with your original message. Urgent. How's everyone holding up? Gently, as not to disturb it. Libby, you're a national goddamn treasure. May I interrupt your scrolling with a turtle duck? You may, and I'm glad you did. I regret naming myself Trump. I thought nobody would vote Trump. Modern problems require modern solutions. I'm willing to bet the man himself didn't expect anybody to vote for him either. Name a more toxic community. I'll wait. Well, that's unfair. I can't name anything else at all. They haven't contacted us yet. I really hope they ban TikTok. The only people I want spying on everything I do are Google, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, the government, Apple, Amazon, every website, my Fitbit, every app. Femboy capitalists be like, pull yourself up by the thigh highs. <laughs> Read a biology textbook. Okay, gender is not the same as sex. Biological sex refers to the anatomical and physiological phenotype. Gender is a category assigned by the individual. Based off behavior and cultural practices, one's gender need not coincide with one's biological sex. No, you can't use a modern textbook. You're never gonna win with someone that keeps moving the goalpost. You just gotta shake your head, walk away, and forget that dip that exists. Remember kids, MK says trans rights. People who need text and image. People who only need text. I, I, uh, I don't like this one. Learned a very relatable term today. Revenge bedtime procrastination. A phenomenon in which people who don't have much control over their daytime life refuse to sleep early in order to regain some sense of freedom during the late hours. And the fact that we have to do that says that there's something really f***ed up about our society. We shouldn't have to spend this much of our lives not really living. <laughs> I hate it when my teacher asks a question in online class and nobody answers. Like, come on guys? I'm not going to answer it either, but really guys? Why are you doing this? Oh, I identify so hard. She said she belonged to the streets. I said, baby, I am the streets. I'm really, really happy that that design has not spread to full body tattoos yet. Soup was invented in 1927 by John Soup when he wanted to drink a chicken. <laughs> Getting a song stuck in your head wouldn't be so bad if it was the full song instead of 10 seconds on loop. Yeah, what the hell's the deal with that? Your son, my son. <laughs> Me finally gets eight hours of sleep. My neck? Yeah, but you did it wrong, lol. <laughs> Starbucks unveils a $7 wake-up slap. My favorite part of this image is how professionally she is delivering that slap. Well, you gotta be able to do your job and do it well, and she is doing it like a veteran. Mom, did you do what I asked you to do? My sibling and I? Uh, hold on, hold on. Uh, no. No, we didn't even think about it. Shortest month and you select me? This will not be forgotten. Peter, I think it's been forgotten, man. Why does this German news show look like a god tier sh post? Why wouldn't it? Really, ask yourself the right questions. Wanna feel old? This is Sub-Zero and Scorpion. That didn't make me feel anything. The four COVID personality types, spotted at the local grocery store, believes in science, denies science, doesn't understand science, believes in magic. No, the two on the bottom are literally the same as the guy in the top right. 
They're just wearing the mask like that so that it will make people shut up. 1960s, a mother used a trash can to contain her baby while she crocheted in the park. Well, as long as the trash can was empty. Nah, I'm just kidding. That baby probably caught some kind of disease from that trash bin. These are the types of things that were socially okay back then that the boomer generation would have us believe were normal and fine and we should be able to keep doing them. They just got pissed off. We told them to stop putting their babies in. I don't know why, but I think it has to do with whether or not you're right or left-handed. And as I've mentioned before, left-handed people aren't real. So of course it's going to feel weird. At my daughter's school, it's medieval day. Everyone else wore Disney princess dresses or homemade night costumes. This kid marches to his own drum. Hashtag Plague Doctor. Respect. And it's probably the best looking costume at his entire school. Once you've read the dictionary, every other book you read is just a remix. That may be the case, but I'm not gonna read the goddamn dictionary. Excellent prose, but the plotline? All over the place. Sad reality. Oh no. No, not one of the- oh! Well, color me surprised. Once I became a parent, I finally understood the scene where Yoda gets so tired of answering Luke's questions, he just dies. Is that why he died, though? I know we don't really know what species he is, but he said he was, what, 900 years old? I bet he was pretty tired because of that. And yes, I'm very fun at parties when I'm invited. Teacher, anyone have any questions? Students, no. All right, go ahead and get started. Students one minute later. If you're a teacher and you genuinely don't understand why this is happening, maybe you shouldn't be a teacher, I'm just saying. Teacher, Chris, could you come solve this problem? Me, oh, we got a problem? That's right, me, teacher. Oh God, I got money on teacher over there. That dude's probably seen some crap. More. More! The girl you like, her father, her brother, her ex, her crush, you. I've got nothing here. I'm very confused. How 2020 started. Hey, it's me, Pandora. Welcome to my new unboxing video. <laughs> I love it when Facebook creeps into Reddit. Instead of texting on my way, I'm just going to start sending these. On my way to see Bay versus heading home from Bay's house. Are you okay, man? No offense to myself or whatever, but what the hell am I actually doing? I have to ask myself that every day. I have no clue. You just gotta roll with the punches, man. When you eat an ice cream and start nibbling wooden stick, what, you become a Canadian? Is it a universal thing to brush your teeth an hour before the dentist to try and hide the prior six months of neglect? Oh, absolutely. The dentists are scary. And we think that doing that an hour before our appointment will somehow trick the guy with years and years and years of training and experience. They ain't stupid. They're gonna find it. It's gonna be embarrassingly fast and it's not gonna be pleasant. So you may as well sit back, relax, keep your mouth open and shut up. If you think boys discuss girls or any other naughty stuff when they meet, you're wrong. All they talk about is career choices, politics, corruption, and their miserable routine. Boy talk is boring as hell. Bye, boys. Never before have I been so offended by something I 100% agree with. Your sad alcoholic name equals your first name plus your last name. Oh, yeah, I guess I am an alcoholic, huh? My Tinder profile says I love mountains, not I love hiking. Distinct but subtle difference. Let's sit on the lawn of a cute B&B in Vermont and drink sangria while admiring the peaks, but not climb them. I repeat, we do not climb them. I make transactions for a multi-billion dollar company. I work at McDonald's. The Egyptian Mao is probably the oldest breed of cat. In fact, the breed is so ancient that its name is the Egyptian word for cat. Did they name it Mao because that's the sound cats make? Now I'm just imagining a very early Egyptian encountering a wild cat for the first time. Human, what the heck are you? Cat, meow. Human, oh, okay then. So the dolphin asked her to marry him and she kisses the other guy right in front of her. Wow, wow. That's low, dude. When you hold down the A button too soon on Mario Kart, you gotta wait until just after the two. Otherwise, Luigi uses his magical powers to burn you to death. When your girlfriend tells you to take off your Buzz Lightyear Crocs during sex, don't ask me to stop being a man. Look, the Crocs always stay on. Will to live? I've got the will to live. Wh hey. It's gone. Well, you can't expect it to hang around all day, can you? Remember when a lemur singing I like to move it was the funniest thing you'd ever seen in your entire life? I genuinely don't remember that being the funniest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> I mean, come 
come on. It was never that goddamn funny. Rich people are so easily convinced about ghosts. I remember growing up, it was near this vacant lot, and whenever I broke a toy, instead of going to face the wrath of my mother, I would frickin' bury it in that lot. And then sure enough, some dude tried to develop the land and found a ton of buried rotten dolls and shit, and told everyone it was haunted. It's been over a decade, and that lot is still vacant. You single-handedly tank the value of someone's prime real estate, and that makes me happy. As soon as I read this, I immediately started thinking of ways to do this on purpose to get cheap land, and I was five posts down my dash before I realized I was becoming a Scooby-Doo villain. Me, when I see a cop, just don't act suspicious and I'll be fine. The cop, good morning. Me, I do not kill people. That is my least favorite thing to do. You are the reason I am named KFC1. Die, KFC. <laughs> What's your name? John. Oh, well, yep, there it goes. Sorry about that. I'm gonna have to ask you again in about 30 seconds. Titanic replica could set sail by 2022, following original route. Should survive this time, considering we've melted all the icebergs. Ooh. That's cold, man. Or a little warmer, I guess. You can now buy a Belle Delphine bathwater cooled PC. Say what you will about this woman, she's probably made millions of dollars off of the stupidest people on the internet. Bravo! Everybody give her a round of applause right now. People who say go big or go home seriously underestimate my willingness to go home. Like, it's literally my only goal for most of the day. Yeah, I kind of like home, and I kind of don't like here, so I'm gonna go home. I think Cartman said it best when he said, screw you guys, I'm going home. How to haunt? No. Haunting for beginners. No. Don't be too hard on yourself. You might already be doing better than you think. Hey, I'm not coming into work today. Why? I fucking hate this job. Understandable. Enjoy the rest of your day. Can you imagine having a manager like that? Where you can say that to them and they're just, you know what? Totally fine, man. I'll see you tomorrow. Why isn't my mouse working? Because it's a goddamn hamster. No, because it's not plugged in properly. You know what you need to do. Now hiring a girlfriend. Full time. Please love me. I mean, I could give it a go. How much does it pay? Ancient Greek astrologers be like, ah, yes, a goat. Yeah, I can see it. Do you care if I take the skin off of the Furby? I want to make him a god. Once he is free of his sinful flesh, he can begin the path towards enlightenment. He will take care of us. Also, I want to soft hack his circuits. I literally could not care less, but never say anything as frightening as that ever again. Do you want to boost your funeral? Hire me, the professional mourner, to come and cry at the funeral. Below are the summer special prices. Number one, normal crying, $50. Number two, Bahamian hollering, $100. Number three, crying and rolling on the ground, $150. Four, crying and threatening to jump into the grave, $200. Five, crying and actually jumping into the grave, $1,000. I think I'm gonna set aside a grand for when I die. What the hell is a frog? Frogs are polite and use manners. They literally just vibe. Sometimes frogs pretend to be harvest mice for fun. Ah! Earth is flat. Evidence you're wrong. Evidence you're right. <laughs> hey, man. Nothing like an echo chamber when you've got your ears plugged. Someone asked me if I had plans for the fall. It took me a moment to realize they meant autumn, not the collapse of civilization. How do you know that's what they meant, though? For real, you gotta look around you, my guy. Parents outraged after man installs electric fence to keep kids off of his lawn. It's my yard. Well, I can't say that's something I would do, but you gotta respect the investment there. Look, at the parents aren't going to be parents to keep them off my lawn, I guess you know what? It's time to learn some valuable lessons. Like how awesome alternating current is. One egg a day equals five cigarettes a day. Egg yolk is so bad for us. Please watch What the Health on Netflix. I've never smoked an egg in my life. I also completely refuse to believe for one second that a single egg does as much damage to your body as a rat poison infused cigarette let alone five of them. Now, of course, I'm gonna look this up later and be proven completely wrong, but at least I'm the type of person who changes my opinions based on the facts presented to me. I know my boss is sick of me. Did you call a customer dumb tonight? No. I said, are you dumb? I was asking him. Do you think that was appropriate? Very much so. That's fair, it probably was incredibly appropriate. Person, a drunken mind speaks a sober heart. Me, drunk as hell. 
<laughs> like Beast Churger. <laughs> oh, could I get a couple crunky Beast Churgers? Dreams be like, do you have school tomorrow? Yes, shut up. Oh look, it's what I see when I rub my eyes really hard. Me, whenever I need more words in my essay, don't, do not. Biology says that you're 7% blood. Chemistry says that you're 70% water. Physics say that you're 99.9999999999% empty space. Luigi says you're 100% depressed. Hey Luigi, would you please mind your own business, man? When I fell, nothing would happen to me. I wasn't delicate like you kids. Well, Grandpa, you also couldn't really do much more than literally just take phone calls. Meanwhile, I am used to take ding-dong pics on Snapchat at least 46 times a day. Now you tell me who's more important. Data, information, knowledge, insight, wisdom, conspiracy theory. Me, building sand castles with my grandmother, everyone else in the crematorium. Wait a minute, the jazz music stopped. When you push the vacuum cleaner over a spot of dirt in your apartment and you hear that crackle. Oh yeah. Heard my husband scream, no! from across the house, ran to see if he was okay, then discovered him watching that video of the raccoon who tries to wash his cotton candy and then appears visibly upset when it dissolves in the water. So you're telling us your husband's an incredibly good person. What do people do in the shower for 45 minutes? Concerts, meet and greets, cry, overthink, arguments, you name it. It really is a box of imagination. Usually takes me about 45 minutes to record one of these videos. If MK hits 5 million subs sometime in the next year or two, I'll record an entire episode in the shower. I know, I'm really good at motivating fan bases. Man, that video would sound like shit. <laughs> Let's move on, man. The joke's over. Haha, <laughs> you're so cool and funny. Uh, uh... What have you done? He doesn't know how to deal with compliments. Sup, ugly. Ah, sup. When someone explains something to you three times and you still have no idea what's going on, why do you think I don't have a real job? Me making weird faces under my mask in front of the cashier. Dang, you have excellent lip control. All right, I'll bite. What do I do for a living? Work as a butler in a haunted mansion and put your little hand in the mashed potatoes? <gasps> wow. Absolutely uncanny. Who remembers these mofos? I remember one burned you alive and the other one gave you electric shocks. Yeah, those tube slides basically gave you electroshock therapy. British people be like, who wants to play amongst us? How are these funny? You work too much. You should be enjoying life. You're wasting time. You should be working more. You know what, Brain? What do you want from me? <laughs> I don't know. It wants chemicals, but the only thing that can give the brain the good chemicals is the brain. Therefore, we are stuck between a rock and a load of bullshit. <laughs> Ang, boomer Ang. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> me, how long should I roast asparagus in the oven? Food blogger, wondering how long to roast asparagus? Come here, I've got your answer. Cool, thank. I was born on a farm in Tennessee. My father was an angry man with three fingers on each hand. A war injury? Try to look up any Adobe tutorial online, you'll get the same damn thing. But instead of family stories, they're usually droning on about how you should smash the like button with your left testicle if you're a bro. Look at this beautiful dog. I thought the cup was blasting off. Yeah, that took me a minute too. Found this bird. Is this yours? No name tag. Yelled every name at it, doesn't respond to any. Obeys no command. Very poorly trained. Well, if nobody claims him, I will. I just got arrested for being too ugly. Can someone come bail me out? On my way. Can someone come bail me out? Payment processing. Payment processing. Approved. <laughs> That's right. Put the gun away, guy. Person, we need to talk later. Me. First of all, I have anxiety. Tell me now. I consider it at least a little bit abusive if you do this to somebody, especially if you know that they get incredibly anxious and paranoid. Fuck you. 16 year old doesn't do drugs, smoke, go to parties, swear, talk back, or have sex, and gets good grades. 16-year-old plays video games. Parents, anger. Yeah, they stop liking it when you have fun very, very fast, and it's quite creepy. Yes, creepy. They banned push pops in school because people were sucking them into pointy weapons. What? Where was this? Ah, man, there are a lot of really good jokes I could make about this one, but I know it's not good for Mr. Advertising, so I'm gonna go ahead and move on now. Wait, I'm alone. Always have been, friend. Always have been. Turn it upside down and it's an alien reading Torah. You're welcome. Yeah, thanks. 
And on that incredibly unfunny note, we've come to the end of another video, ladies and gents. Made some 3D fan art. My Insta is at the Digipainter. All right, let's take a look at this 3D fan art, shall we? Oh, <laughs> this looks kind of scary, I'm not gonna lie. It's freaking me out a little bit, man. Always remember, if you even somewhat enjoyed this video, to drop a like down below. And if you really enjoyed it, well, then make sure to get subscribed and click that bell icon. And until next time, we'll catch you later.